Good morning. It is 7.58 a.m. on Friday, January 27th, 2017. I am Christiana Ellis, and I just got up. This is five more minutes. So, I'm feeling pretty good today. I'm not sure what's going on with that. Um, <laughs> uh, but I am. And uh, so, Part of it, I think, at least right now, is just that we had a really fun session of so many levels uh, last night. Uh, I enjoyed that quite a bit. One of the things that I think was key to it was to uh, let my heroes be heroes. Funny. Uh, so anyway, um, I had something else. Oh, it's it was a gorgeous morning out right now. It's uh, warmer than it's been in a little while. Uh, patchy, uh, patchy clouds here and there, but, uh, some sun and some blue, uh, which is pretty nice. Um, just took Luna out and it's just nice. Just like take a deep breath. Ah, <sighs> good morning. And, uh, um, I'm trying to remember there was, there's like a couple of other things that I had in mind that I was going to talk about as soon as I sat down and then, whew. oh, one of them is, uh, a web comic known as Strong Female Protagonist. And I'm pretty sure I've talked about it before on these videos, but it's been a while, I'm sure. Um, the only trick in terms of recommending it now is that it's been going a while. And right now, it and it's complex enough that it's not super easy to just pick up right now, like where we're at. But it's amazing. And so the, the, the quirk of it is that either... I recommend that you start at the beginning, and so you have a lot of ground to cover, which I suppose could is a mixed thing, right? Because on the one hand, it can be intimidating to say you have to binge through a whole bunch of it, but on the other hand, it's like, oh, but it's actually really good. So, um, so basically, what I'm saying is, if you are already reading it, then you know it's great, and you don't need me to recommend it to you. If you are not already reading it, then what I recommend is that you start at the beginning rather than the part that has got me so enthusiastic about it at the moment. So, <laughs> um, so I think that uh, the, the key here is to say super uh, strong female protagonist is an excellent webcomic um, that really gets into some of the thinky bits of superhero comics, which makes me happy. Uh, for example, right now, they're having... The main character has done something that is pretty objectively would be considered like a wrong action, except that it was the only way to bring about a very good thing. And she's really struggling with it um, because she feels like she feels like she's tainted herself a little bit, um, and or maybe that she should have found some other way. Um, and so she's struggling with it. And now they're having a pretty in-depth ethical discussion about essentially: do the ends justify the means, and if so, when and under what conditions? Because on the one hand, you know, you want to say they don't justify the means, but on the other hand, it's kind of like if you could stop a war by killing one person, you know, do you just let the war continue so that you don't have to dirty your hands? It's an interesting question. And so the, and it's really wrestling with that in a sophisticated way. And I think that's really cool. And that's just, you know, the current arc um, after many, uh, many fascinating things. So I strongly recommend it. Um, already talked about having a great So Many Levels session. Um, uh, Mike and I, I believe, are going to start our Oscar marathon uh, tonight. So tune into that if you are interested. And uh, I think... Yeah, that's that's pretty much kind of what I've got on my mind at the moment. Um, uh, 
uh, I guess one just last little note that I was amused by is that I, I just scanning some of the uh, blog articles this morning, um, I noticed that the premiere of the CW's new Riverdale show, where it's basically like, let's turn Archie comics into a murder mystery, which has me... Just at the premise, but uh, then the reviews for the show are actually, like, really good, so. I don't know. I'm not sure I need more TV shows to watch right now, but I am interested, having read some of those reviews now. Anyway, we'll see. Uh, so I will talk to you guys tomorrow for five more minutes.